In this feature video, we're going to take a look at a new feature which is introduced on our 195 stables, which is being able to repatch fixtures from the output plan window. So if we take a look at my magic view here, I'm in the output window in the view plan view. So open up the output window here, view plan, and you can have multiple grids, custom grids, which you can set on your A encoder. And here uh, we can drop heads and groups in here. So we can literally just copy uh, and enter fixture numbers. There's a view grid on and off function. So when you have the view grid off, it's more of a selection uh, thing for playback or selecting fixtures for programming. Even If I turn the view grid on, I can edit. So I can drop head numbers in here. Okay, I could put head number 14 there by just typing in a head number, clicking in a space or selecting multiples. Okay, head number 10 there, and it would put in 10, 11, 12, and 13 across those spaces. Now, in previous videos, we've looked at how you can customize this window so we can set the icons and, and change the different shapes of fixtures, as you can see here. In our 195 stable, we've given you a little bit more in this window. So it's a nice visual window where we can see the layout of our fixtures, how they are in my rig. So I have a head test, so I can go on and I can click on fixtures to test them. So from that, I can also now change my view type to patch, and it will show me then the universe and address of fixtures. So I can go on and repatch a fixture. I could say repatch uh, the selected fixture, this spot here, and I can type in a new universe and channel, okay, universe uh, 12, channel one, enter, and that's now been repatched to that location there. So that's being able to repatch fixtures from the output window.